is that I, Bellow, whose destiny must be to rule the entire universe, continue to be thwarted by a, a flea, a microbe, whose powers are as nothing compared to mine. Yet mice cause mountains to crumble. I tire of the struggle. I curse you, Laszlo. May the pestilence increase. May it consume you utterly. Oh, mistress, the bracelet and scarabaeus will soon be yours. Oh, thank you. Where? Sanadu. Sanadu? China. The Middle Ages. Are you Kubla Khan? His son, Abaz Khan. Oh. I am deputizing for him. Come. Your father still rules, then? You might describe it so. That is a shrine made of adamant, a stone harder than diamonds, impenetrable to all but him. What's in the center, behind the flames? The secret to all things, protected by the fire of life. The secret to all things? A philosopher's stone which transports him to mystic planes. An old man's toy. That is where he spends most of his time. He has even abandoned the affairs of state to a foreigner, Marco Polo. Marco Polo? Of course. You have heard of him? Indeed I have. Well, who has not? He is most accomplished in singing his own praises. But things will change. Come with me. What did you mean, things will change? That is the reason I summoned you. I have been given the powers of the shaman. Why me? You are the neutralizing factor. Neutralizing what? In fact, things are already changing. <laughs> Clever, eh? Crude magic using Bellor's powers. Effective, no less. If you can walk through it, I'll certainly find a way. Oh, not without the soup, lad. With it, I can dance inside a volcano. Asbestos, not even magic. And what's this? I don't carry weapons. A bracelet. Haven't got it. Hard luck. Mm. A green disease is spreading fast, I see. Still, you'll melt long before that kills you. Don't be too sure. Why not call on Laszlo to save you? It's your only hope. And let you grab the bracelet? No chance. Then scream for help. No one will hear you. Laszlo! <laughs> Laszlo! Where are you? The word is corruption, Marco Polo. <laughs> Necessary payments, Prince Ibars. Fees to tax gatherers. Payments to overseers. Special rewards. 
to palace officials for outstanding services. Bribes, Messer Marco. Oh. It could be argued that you, a foreigner, are attempting to buy the loyalty of my father's own retinue. I assure you that is not the case, Prince Ipas. Then we have the enormous cost of your expedition to India. But look, we need the elephants and the horses and the camels, the dragmen, the trackers and the bears. Well, the list is endless. But the trip was successful. We conquered in the name of Kublai Khan. And I'm sure my father was suitably grateful. You have grown rich, Marco Polo. I came from Venice 25 years ago to make my fortune. I do not return empty-handed. I have spent nothing that was not absolutely essential. I hope you can prove that. For the penalty for corruption in our court is, alas, quite final. You threaten me, Prince Ibars. If I may advise you, Marco Polo, I should get your scribe to write a clear account of all monies you have expended in the last three years on behalf of the Emperor. How can I do that? I have to go for all of these scrolls! Do so! I must depart. My betrothed, the Princess Ogunu, has recently arrived from the Northern Empire to discuss my forthcoming marriage. <laughs> Frighten account! Why, most of the payments were made to the Empress, hundreds of so close his relatives. Look, look! How do you explain a birthday party to 6,000 little Kublers, hmm? Princess Ogunu, my beloved, the young stranger is now trapped in the chamber of death. Good. There is something else I require from you. Name it. The secret to all things. That worthless relic? If it is the key to all the mysteries, then it will teach me how to be the perfect consort for you. Then you shall have it. If only we can break through the walls of the shrine. Leave that to me. Watch the stars. They are about to cross. When they do, you will sit upon the throne, not as a surrogate, but as emperor of all the world. Laszlo! Laszlo, where are you? Laszlo, please help me. Well, Bram? I questioned him, mistress. I don't think he knows where Laszlo is. Have you been monitoring his thoughts? As best I can. I'm no good at mind matters. I get terrible headaches. Now, anything physical... Shh. I will follow his inner voice. Stay alert. <laughs> Laszlo, help me. Laszlo, I know you're around. You must be. Gratuities, the bribes, the payments. I don't know where all the money went. Oh, I'm sure the Emperor will understand Marco Polo. But Prince Ibars, he won't. He's always been jealous and now he wants to destroy me. I must concentrate. Laszlo, help me, I'm trapped. Don't bother me now, I'm too busy. You spoke, sire. What? Oh, no, no, you may leave me, my dear. The special rations for the Imperial Hounds. Somebody's been making a fortune from the doggies' dinners. Laszlo, please help me. Phil? Is that you? Yes, Laszlo. Look, I'm in a terrible trouble. You'll have to leave me for a moment. So, Laszlo, you think I do not know you as Marco Polo? <laughs> well, well. I'm in a fire cage. All Bellor's doing. Bellor? I might have known. Help me get out. All right, hold on, Phil. I'm trying. I'm weakening, Phil. I can't seem to generate enough magical power. Hold on. Wait. I will ask Kubler Khan to help me. Hurry, Laszlo. Hurry. Yes, Marco, I am capable of investing you with magical powers. But I must not. But, my liege, if you do, you will have in me an even stronger right hand. The Empire will be doubly protected. The Empire is not threatened. We rule by the scepters of love, tolerance and friendship. Our realm is an island refuge in the sea of man's evil. I have need of exceptional powers. A friend is in trouble. If I were to grant you magical powers, it would alter the great design of the universe. But he is in terrible danger. If it is so willed, Marco, 
You shall regain your magical powers without my help. Whatever the problem, I cannot assist you. That is your final decision? Regrettably, my friend. <laughs> I'm sorry. I have been distracted from our main purpose of finding this carabas, and I'm weakened. I am going to channel what's left of my powers through to you. But that might finish you. We're doomed anyway unless we find the carabas and quickly. You are our only hope. The sands have whispered. It is time. You must kill Kubla Khan. Kill my father. You want to rule the world? So be it. But I cannot do the deed myself. I shall find an assassin. Very well, but it must be someone he does not suspect, someone close to him. That strange European within the court. Marco Polo. But he is loyal to my father. He can be tricked. How? I shall make you a weapon. An ingenious explosive firecracker that can be triggered by Kublai Khan's touch. And I shall decorate it beautifully. You will prevail upon Marco Polo to present it to Kublai Khan as a gift. Yes, perfect. That will also enable me to dispose of Marco Polo. I've never liked him. No. Hand Marco Polo over to me. Burden you with petty matters, my dearest? I have my reasons. He possesses an heirloom stolen from my people. A bracelet. I must recover it. He is yours. Now for the device. Follow your destiny. It could work, Laszlo. If we get the voice right. Bram! Concentrate on the prisoner. Sit beside him. Watch his every move. At once, mistress. I don't need your company. Oh, I'd be told to keep an eye on you. It's roasting in here. Yes. <laughs> well... Always the nasty ones, eh? What nasty ones? Jobs. Your mistress treats you like a slave. Well... Oh, no, she doesn't. Well, look at you in that heavy asbestos suit, itching for dear life. <laughs> itching? Oh, I'm not itching. Oh, yes, I oh, am. Yeah. And that's not all. It's really dangerous, that asbestos clothing. Very unhealthy. Is it? Poisons the lungs. Oh, does it? She treats you worse than a slave. Like a dog. What can I do? She controls me. <laughs> Don't think I haven't tried to escape. Maybe I could help. Oh, no. Don't you try that on me. It's the oldest trick in the game. No, it isn't. This is. What is? You are feeling, you are feeling sleepy. Sleepy. You are feeling, you are feeling sleep, sleepy. No, I'm not. <laughs> Hypnosis. You think I'd fall for that one? You are falling, you are falling asleep. asleep. You are falling, you are falling asleep. asleep. More power, Laszlo. More power. Not falling asleep. You are uh, asleep. asleep. You, you are, are asleep. I am asleep. <laughs> have taken my advice, Marco Polo. A lengthy task, Prince Ibars. Perhaps you should seek my father's help. He has magical powers. I did. He refused. Try again. Take a gift. <gasps> a gift? <laughs> you mean a bribe, hmm? Take this. An exquisite firecracker, given to me by my betrothed. It would delight him. But how can you bear to part with it? Your life is more valuable than anything I possess. Take it. That's a very kind of you. <laughs> <laughs> Bram, tell me Bello's plan. She has followed your thoughts. She will kill Kubla Khan and accuse Laszlo of the murder. How? He has been given a present for Kubla Khan, a lethal firework disguised as a gift. No. 
Bellor will possess Laszlo's bracelet and secure the Scarabaeus. The Scarabaeus? Where is it concealed? Within the secret to all things, behind the wall of flame. right under my nose. I must tell Phil. Laszlo, I've escaped. Where are you? Laszlo! Where are you? Phil, is that you? I have found this Scarabaeus. I'm coming. Only a few more minutes. Laszlo! John! Phil! Phil, am I glad to see you? Listen, the Scarabaeus is in the secret to all things. I know, it's behind the wall of fire. We shall need to make a plan. Did you present a gift to the Kublai Khan? Yes, a firecracker. Prince Ibar, she gave it to me. It's an explosive. He'll be killed. But I didn't give it to him. He wasn't there. So I left it on the throne. Quick, we must go and get it. Ram! You let him escape! Did I? My shoot! He hypnotized me! Did he make you talk? I, we conversed. You fool! Now he knows our plans! My head, I told you, not very strong when it comes to mind matters. The bomb, he will try to neutralize it. <sighs> Mistress, I need another suit or I'll perish of cold. <laughs> Keep going, Laszlo. Not far now. <laughs> not here. It must be. Kubla Khan, he must have picked it up. I've got to find him. Wait! He wasn't meditating. Come! Ah, oh, Marco, you have brought another stranger to our court. Welcome. Strangers complete a realm as the soul completes a man. Uh, thank you, Your uh, Highness. Yeah, my liege, uh, I brought you a gift. It was a firecracker. A gift? Where? I left it on the throne. You didn't pick it up? No, but I, I would like to inspect it. Firecrackers fascinate me. Oh, it's not a firecracker. It's a bomb. Bomb? What is that, please? One of your delightful devices from Europe? What does it do? It goes a bang, my liege. It was meant to destroy you. Oh. Oh, no, surely you would not. Oh, no. no, not him, Highness. Your son, Abar's Khan. He is plotting to assassinate you. Nonsense. I shall summon Abar's. I'm sure you are mistaken. But the bomb, Your Majesty, they could plant it anywhere. We must find it. This is most puzzling. Let us search for this bomb. Understand. You should have killed Kublai Khan yourself. First law for an aspiring Emperor Abars, do your own dirty work. But killing my own father! Choose. Your conscience or your destiny? Destiny, of course. Good. We must strike while Kublai Khan is absent. What must
must we do? Blow up the wall. I must have the secret to all things. But the wall is adamant, indestructible. Stop arguing. The explosion will bring Kublai Khan and Marco Polo running. You deal with Kublai Khan, I with Marco Polo. Take cover. That came from the throne room. Quick, follow Kublai Khan. Days now end. <laughs> Blood the lock. You are very powerful. Yes. But I am immortal. So am I. You must be. Yes. Bella. Phew! I'll subdue the fire. You get the scarabaeus. Fire forces Maximus. Fred of Thomas. It's no good, Phil. I'm weak, me. The heat is too intense. Wait! The asbestos suit! Go on, Phil! Go on! Quick! Give it! It doesn't fit, Phil. This is not the Scarabaeus. What? It must be! No, it is not, Bello. And what is more, you've set father against son and all for nothing. You have lost as well, Laszlo. Cease! You are engaged in an evil conflict. You will do anything to gratify your lust for power. Now you shall be punished, witch! <laughs> Dependent! That's the Scarabaeus! I placed it here when I realized Bellor's true intentions. The object you have seized is a paltry replica. Take this. Ah! I deny it to you all! No good, Phil. I just don't have enough power. No one can alter the great design. You must go on. Come on, Phil. Ah! 